The former Bethlehem Steel Factory in Leedsdale is back open. Here's an aerial look at the facility captured by Sky 2. But this time Bethlehem Steel and Next Trackers are working together to serve the solar power industry. Brianna Smith took a tour this morning. The BCI Steel CEO says they'll produce essential parts for solar panels nationwide. He says not only will they create jobs in the Pittsburgh region, but they'll help produce more clean energy for the future. This is a big day for BCI Steel. We as a region have not been manufacturing here for a long time. That we're fixing that. So it's bringing it back, bringing it back to life. BCI Steel CEO Matt Carroll says they'll help supply solar tracker parts in Pennsylvania, Ohio, and other areas of the mid Atlantic region. The trackers follow the sun and enhance solar energy. He says the factory in Leedsdale is the perfect location, being near the Ohio River, railway, and I 79. From a transportation standpoint, it makes a lot of sense. We're also in the valley, the workforce here. I mean, we've got second, third generation steel workers. Then uh, we found some really, really good ones. Carol says there are about 70 positions and they're still hiring. Meanwhile, he gave local and national leaders a tour of the facility on Tuesday. It's going to put a lot of our people to work, but it also shows our commitment to investing in, fu in the future. The bipartisan infrastructure law that was passed last year is going to put a lot of money into these type of projects and this type of an investment in energy and sustainability. Uh, and it's an exciting time to be in Pittsburgh. The U.S. Energy Secretary says the ultimate goal is to be energy independent and only manufacture products in America. She says the steel city is leading the way. I chose Pittsburgh because Pittsburgh. Pittsburgh is the emblematic community that has risen from the ashes. Pittsburgh is also leading in energy and in manufacturing, and other countries want to learn what was it that Pittsburgh did that made it successful. Carroll believes this will be yet another success. He plans to send out the first shipment on July 11th. In Leedsdale, Brianna Smith, KDKA News.